everybody. I'm recording this short introduction uh, video to On the Road with me, Peter van Impen. Uh, and uh, just to explain to you guys a little bit what it's all about and why I made it. Um, I started to make this video because I think that uh, either professional or professional or aspiring professional photographers or, or hobbyists that start out with photography, they spend way too much time on the technical part of photography. It's always like, yeah, you know, the, the lighting this and then and the framing in the image and the composition and that's all very important. But if you cannot uh, handle, if you cannot make conversation, make conversation with your model, with the couple that you're shooting, if you don't know how to behave, if you behave wrong yourself, yeah, either the way you talk or the way you behave, the way you move your body, the way you use whatever you have on your body, and if you don't know how to counteract certain moods of, of, of couples or a model or of or certain uh, tics that they have, like when they're kind of like a little bit nervous and stuff, um, you have to be able to counteract that. And nobody talks about, or hardly anyone talks about that. They're all talking about, yeah, you have to pose like this and this and this. But hardly anyone talks about how can you uh, achieve a certain pose or a certain spontaneous smile, for example, in someone that's really 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 over the top nervous yeah so i'll be uh, trying to explain you guys give you guys a little uh, hints and stuff how you guys can all use both body language and uh, it's also part part psychology how you can use body language and the way you talk and what you can say and what what techniques you can use uh, to achieve certain situations to achieve certain results so it's two very important parts uh, to me photography is like 10% technical and 90% uh, psychological I'm not talking about professional models we use professional models it's like do this do that do this I hope you're not like that but in you should be you could do it because you pay them a lot of money to, to do their job uh, so be a nice photographer and eh? be friendly to them but if you want you could do, do this do that do this and they should be able to do it but not so when you just have a client come over and he wants support with shoot or she wants support with shoot or you're shooting a wedding that's not the case so it's really important to use every skills that you might be able to learn in order to achieve a better result. And that's not only the technical part. The technical part is a small part of photography. Everything around it, the psychological part, is very, very important. And I will try to explain to you guys and I will try to, to prove that and I will try to help you guys achieve that and get better at it. I hope you enjoyed the series. If you have any suggestions, subject that you want me to talk about, feedback. Uh, if you hate my clips, if you don't like my face, whatever, let me know, drop it in the YouTube comments, send me an email. Uh, I'll try and reply to you guys as fast as possible, as soon as possible, and I'll try to reply anyone. But let me know, okay? Give me some feedback so I can give you guys what you want. Bye-bye.